You don't have to own it to appreciate it. That's true. Wisdom. <laughs> you guys always appreciate how we, uh, in my videos, I always say, like, you don't have to buy this stuff. It's just for fun. It's just extra. You know where I learned that mindset? This gal right here. Hey everyone, it's Natalie. Welcome to my channel. Today I am sharing with you another Christmas decor come shop with me video. And this time we are going to Hobby Lobby and Target. Those are the places that you guys requested when I asked you over on my Instagram. And I'm super excited to go window shopping, check out some of the trends, see what they have in stock. I don't necessarily go shopping in these videos to find a bunch of stuff because I'm a huge advocate for just reusing the decor that you've had for years I mostly love to go in just to see what the trends and the styles are and just to get some inspiration and ideas for how to reuse my own stuff but I have a couple of things in mind and along the way if I do pick some stuff up I will be sharing those things with you guys toward the end of this video in an affordable or sort of like mini haul I like to keep things affordable and practical and a little bit more on the minimal side than what you would see typically here on YouTube I don't go all out I don't get all crazy and I just want to be an encouragement to you guys that you don't have to keep up with the Joneses when it comes to making your house cozy and cute and beautiful and inviting for the holiday season. I've said it before, I don't really need this stuff and you guys probably don't need this stuff so don't feel the pressure to just go out and buy new stuff for the Christmas time. But if you are curious what the stores have, then let's go to Hobby Lobby and Target. And if you want to check out the other Christmas Shop With Me video that I did, I went to Marshalls, Michaels, and uh, Bath and Body Works, then I will leave that video linked in the description box and up here on the cards for you but a little bit earlier I met my mom and we took my little girl Haley with us and we went to Hobby Lobby so I'll show you what we found there first okay we found the Christmas section over there in our Hobby Lobby there's like nothing Christmassy but over here oh my goodness no, we don't eat it. It's not eat real it? gingerbread. We gotta, we gotta make gingerbread together. Oh my gosh. Oh, it's so cute. So the nice thing about Hobby Lobby compared to other stores that I've been in for Christmas stuff is that they have displays set up with all like the same themed stuff. So we have like baking themed, like silver and white themed. They have like jewel tones over there. So if you're looking for something specific, you can find it all in like one spot. That makes shopping easier. I really appreciate that. And then they have like rustic farmhousey. Oh, look at this, the red and black buffalo check. Just like Michael's, it's all the rage. And they have more like whimsical, bottle brush trees. I love this. It's not quite maroon, but not quite plum. Yeah, That's so it's like pretty. Rainy, yeah. Very. Yeah, so pretty. Okay, mom is on the hunt for a taco ornament for Uncle Luke, her son, Haley's uncle, just, just to clarify. Oh, there's some hot dogs down there. Chili <laughs> sauce. So it looks like all their Christmas decor right now is 50% off. Here's an avocado. <laughs> My sister just got engaged, how cute is this? So cute, they have like every ornament you can think of. Oh, aren't these cute? Oh, little ballet slippers. What are those? Are those so pretty? And it's $5.99 and you know what? It's half off. Okay, <laughs> you can look at it. Oh, it's so pretty. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh. Look, he's got little fuzzies on his face. Hang on. Look at him. A little hedgehog with a mushroom hat. That is so cute. I'm getting it. So we have all gold here. All like candy stripe. And then there's white and blue, like wintry. And more like rustic or like country-ish. How you can add, like you already have a gold theme. Yeah. You can add to it. Yeah, let's go to the gold aisle and just grab one or two things. Or the candy cane. Or the ugly. <laughs> or the ugly. 
this was like my favorite color back in the day. I think our first Christmas together, yeah. I did a lot of like this aqua color. This is very pretty. I would have loved this aisle. Look at these huge pine cones. I mean, it's like bigger than my hand. That's crazy. And we have found tree skirts and stockings. There's a whole aisle of these in like every style you can think of. Cute, including stockings for a dog. Oh my goodness, look at all these garlands. That's crazy. There's so many. Well, I like the, I know, I was gonna say, I really like the berry ones. And there's like silver. This reminds me of those memes. Oh, the, the Hobby Lobby challenge. <laughs> I still have my garlands, like the eucalyptus one, and then the eucalyptus homemade wreath that I made with the garland, little hack that I did. Okay, so here is the mini Christmas tree aisle. If there's anything I'm gonna buy today, like the main thing that I'm looking for is stuff for the kids' Christmas trees, which that video might already be up on my channel when I uh, decorated the kids' Christmas trees, but this is where I'm like looking for just a couple of things here and there because we've never done Christmas trees in their bedroom like full on before, and so we do need a couple of things for that. They're definitely old enough now that they would love to have that in their rooms. They have this whole line called My Little Christmas, and it's just a bunch of ornaments and doodads, little tree skirts and stuff, tree toppers for small trees. This is exactly where we need to be. So funny, I'm like, I'm getting it anyway, and when she says, can I have those, it's like I'm getting her everything she wants. Yeah. You know what I mean? <laughs> Haley, can you say, just looking? Just looking. Okay, and they also have party supplies. So like an ugly sweater, Christmas party, invitations, a little like photo booth. Thing that you can do that's really cute yeah they just have a bunch of different party stuff so like party games Christmas themed party games and stuff that you can play they got like little uh, snowball shooters <laughs> a sloth Christmas party which I've never heard of one of those but oh <laughs> she loves cuddling party favors if you have a kid with a birthday during Christmas time or you just want to like uh, do a classroom party for like preschool teachers or whatever they have lots of really cute little stocking stuff or party favor stuff here there's a whole Grinch aisle mom look at this well I definitely found Weston's Christmas present there's just aisle after aisle after display after aisle of stuff for Christmas and like everything has its own theme there's just so much stuff, it's overwhelming. You thought Marshall's had a lot? This is like crazy. Oh, so cute. And if Christmas isn't your thing, you can always just have a glow party. Can you dance too? I don't want to. <laughs> okay, okay, Haley, come on. I don't want to either. Hi, guys. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Okay, well, the boys are with us now. I just went and picked them up from preschool, and we are gonna go into Target now. We're gonna let them look at some little Christmas decorations, maybe for their bedroom. What do we talk about, guys? What are we not gonna do when we're in Target? Not touch it and take something off the shelf. Yeah, we're not gonna touch stuff and take it off the shelf, and we're not going to ask for stuff. Ask for stuff. We're not gonna ask for stuff. And what do we say, Haley? Just looking. Just looking. <laughs> Alrighty, let's go in. Okay, so we are in Bullseye's Playground, just looking at some cool stuff. Look at this. Yeah, look at those, those are ornaments. So we're gonna try to find some cute stuff for the little Christmas tree in your bedroom, okay? Got some Christmas baking supplies, little dishes. Oh, cute. Holiday budget planner. Holiday menu planner. These are really cute. That would make like a good gift like newlyweds. I didn't know those though. 
food for last. Oh yeah, we gotta be careful. Oh, Christmas cookie swap. Oh, this is really cute. I love this. Hmm. Oh my goodness, look at that little Charlie Brown. Very, very I'll show cute. it to Grandma. They still have some of their fall stuff Grandma, out. Look at this sock. Like blanket scarves? Very nice. How much are those? Okay. That's still cheaper than if you got it from like the that would you could even use that as a throw, like on a on a um, couch or something. Super cute. Oh, this little Santa sleigh. Oh, cool. The little oh. Look at this little Santa sleigh. So cute. Look at these. Look at these little. Look at these. Oh, erasers. Very cool. We can get these. No, not this time. Why? See, do you see how Grandma and Mommy are looking at stuff? We're like, oh, this is cute, but we're not actually putting it in the cart. Oh, what is that? They have like these little kids' activities. Oh, like little tactile. Cute. Oh, fun. So cute. Five bucks? That's not bad. Okay, so we have three dollar ornaments and five dollar ornaments. Look at Santa. And the little hot air balloon, so cute. The kids are in heaven. They love this so much. Oh, and a little swan. That's exactly what I'm looking for. Found the ornament for Grandma. Except it's not a Trenta size. <laughs> Mom, look at I know, look at all these Christmas trees. So pretty. Okay, so we are noticing that the little custom ornaments, hey, like all the different little novelty things or characters or whatever, it's a lot more expensive here, like almost triple in price actually for some of the ones that they have than what we found at Hobby Lobby. But none of these are actually on sale. So I expect that if they do go on sale, they'll be pretty comparable. But all of the Christmas stuff at Hobby Lobby was 50% off. Um, so it kind of just depends on when you go in, I guess. But the boys were able to pick out a couple of really cute ornaments, which I'll show you in the hall a little later on. Okay, but I will say Target is a better place to find like non-breakable, little soft, more plush ornaments. Um, they're definitely better than Hobby Lobby. They have much more selection than they did over there. Oh, cute little birdie. Liam, Judah, and Haley. So cute. So many bells. Well, actually, those are those are little balls, like Christmas balls. Very cute. Okay, so let's start with what I got at Hobby Lobby. Um, let's start with the boys' room, this decorations for their bedroom and their little Christmas tree. I'm kind of going with the traditional red, silver, and green theme for their decor and then uh, piecing in some Charlie Brown like peanuts stuff because they love Charlie Brown for like Christmas cartoons. So I got this little set, My Little Christmas. You guys saw me um, looking at this at Hobby Lobby. Small sized Christmas ornaments, perfect for a smaller tree. So I got a set of these, everything was 50% off. So that was $2.50 for this set of 18. And another thing from the My Little Christmas tree were these garlands, these little bead garlands. And this is 18 feet for a uh, dollar fifty, so that's good. And then I got them a couple of special ornaments. This says "Home is where Mom is." How cute is that? Um, and then a football ornament for them. And look at how cute these are. I don't know if these are going on their tree or up, strung up somewhere in their bedroom. Um, you'll have to see that clean and decorate with me for Christmas video that I'm doing. Um, but I just thought these little Snoopies were so so cute. And then for Haley's tree, I did pick up these My Little Christmas Tree um, uh, ornaments, but I think they're too small. I think I have to save them for another year. Right now, she's just at the stage where she's putting everything in her mouth, and these are small enough to fit in there. I wouldn't want that to happen, so I'm not gonna open these up. I might return them, just something to keep in mind. When it says My Little Christmas, it doesn't necessarily mean it's appropriate for small children. Um, but I did find these ones. Um, these are the same little My Little Christmas, but they're the same size as these other smaller ornaments, but not 
tiny ornaments. So I just thought these rose gold would be perfect for her little kind of girly ballet themed tree. And I am drawing inspiration from my friend Brianna Kay. She did this in her little girl Presley's room and I thought it was super cute. I'm not doing her whole bedroom ballet themed for Christmas. I think Brianna did Presley's room like ballet nutcracker like full on which it's adorable but we're just kind of going to focus on the tree for some ballet stuff so i found these little ballet slippers a pretty little crystal ballerina it's not true crystal this is actually plastic and then some other sparkly things a little sparkly um butterfly a little sparkly i don't know is this a snowflake something it just caught my eye and these were all 50 percent off each and i think each of them are 3.99 full price so a buck 50 a piece that's a perfect price for just putting together a little girl's christmas tree and the last thing from hobby lobby is this super cute little sparkly hedgehog with a little mushroom hat on this isn't going in their bedrooms this is going on my tree because oh my gosh how stinking adorable so the total that I spent on all of this from Hobby Lobby is like around $20. Let's move on to what I found at Target. Just a couple of things there, but let's start with the boys. Um, these cute little Charlie Brown and Snoopy. These are perfect for their tree. It's going to be perfect with those little lights and the banner that's going up in their room. And then I found this bead garland. This is uh, $3 for 25 feet. Um, I'm not gonna take this out of the package because it's actually cheaper right now to get this bead garland from Hobby Lobby. Um, but these weren't on sale. So I know at some point these are gonna go on sale at Target and they'll be cheaper and they might be a better value than Hobby Lobby. It just kind of depends on when you go. Um, but I thought I'd show you that those were there. And then I got a little tree skirt for their tree. And I got this one for Haley's tree, which I think is just so cute. I love this like fair isle print for them. All the mini tree skirts at Hobby Lobby were only 12 inches in diameter or smaller. Um, and these are 18 inches, which is gonna be good for their three foot trees. Um, they were $8 each, which is more expensive than what I could find at Hobby Lobby. But again, these could go on sale and be cheaper than that. And then I got a bunch of little $3 ornaments um, for Haley's tree. I think this is going to be the tree topper, a cute little crown on top. I got these little rose gold um, uh, little icicles, a little bear ballerina. My mom found this one, a little swan. How pretty. I think this is real glass, so we have to be careful with that. Um, and then I just thought that this would kind of just go with the whole aesthetic of her tree. Again, $3 a piece for these little ornaments, so definitely more expensive than the Hobby Lobby ones, but I was actually remarking to my mom that the ones from Target, they had a lot more of these like completely unbreakable plush sort of options, and I didn't see very much of that at all at Hobby Lobby. So for me, having a Christmas tree set up for a two-year-old, it's definitely worth it to spend a little extra to get ones that are gonna last a little longer and won't be a hazard to her. And um, so that's just my opinion there. And these also are plastic. And I thought like the ones that they had at Target for all of their like character or specialty ornaments were definitely better looking than the ones at Hobby Lobby, even though they were more expensive. I think these were $5 each. And then I did pick up one thing for our tree in our living room. Um, this is just a set of eight shatter resistant ornaments. And last year I was looking everywhere for a gray colored ornament that was not metallic. It's kind of a very specific and obscure request. And so I just didn't find it last year, but I was so excited when I saw these on the shelf at Target. So I have a couple of things for my tree this year, but I have a ton of ornaments already, so I don't really expect that I'll be purchasing anything else for my tree. But yeah, that is everything that I picked up at Target and Hobby Lobby. Thank you guys so much for coming along with me to Hobby Lobby and Target. I'm so glad that I found a few things that are gonna be perfect for the decor in the kids' rooms. Again, be sure to check back here on my channel for that clean and decorate with me for Christmas video where I'm sharing the kids' decor in their bedrooms. And don't forget to subscribe and turn your bell button on so that you guys don't miss my regular Monday videos as well as bonus videos like this one. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I hope you're having a wonderful day wherever you are. Thanks for spending part of it here with me on my channel and I'll catch you later.